Hello everyone. Welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to discuss about what is a missile, how missiles work. Here, a missile is a weapon that can fly through the air and is propelled by a rocket motor or a jet engine. Missiles engine are run by the propellants to create thrust which forces the missile upwards. Missiles can be powered by rocket or a jet engines and they have a several other key components including guidance system. Control systems that adjust the missile's flight path and that is called as a guidance system. Guidance systems can use a technologies like GPS, radio frequency, RF, or laser beams. Warheads, explosives, explosives of missiles called warheads that provide the missile's destructive power. Stabilizing pins keeps the steadiness of the missile during the flight. Aerodynamic features include the airframe, the entire structure of the missile, wings and pins. These will provide the aerodynamic features to the missile so that it can fly with a minimum friction and maximum speed. Here are some other details about how missiles works. First one will take the propellants. Missiles use propellants that is called as a fuels also such as solid, liquid or a hybrid to create a thrust. This will burn, the fuel bur is burned in an engine which can create hot exhaust gases that are funneled through a nozzle at the rear of the missile and that will create a thrust. Solid propellants are used in many missiles from shoulder fire to the intercontinental ballistic missiles. Liquid and hybrid propellants are used in rocket engines. Engine stages. Missiles have multiple engine stages. For example, a ballistic missile may have three stages. A first stage boost motor and a second stage motor and a third stage motor. And one after, after the use of those motors, those will detach from the missile and further those the missile will travel. Launch. Some missiles may be launched with additional propulsion from catapult, cannon and tank gun. Or a missile, they will have the one the propulsion also. Flight. Cruise missiles are jet propelled at subsonic speed. The speed is less than the sun speed less than one mark number. While ballistic missiles are rocket powered in the initial phase of the flight and later follow the unpowered trajectory to travel and reach the target. Some other things to know about the missiles include ballistic missiles use an inertial guidance system to compare the missile's actual speed and position to the positions it needs to hit the target. There is a comparison and actual speed with the uh, required speed to reach the target. The some missiles use pneumatic timers to create time delay action. The footprint of a missile is the area that's visible for targeting given the characteristics of the re-entry vehicle. Here, the different types of the missiles will have the different types of the fuels they have used, different stages they are using and the different whatever the propulsion engines also they are going to use the different and there are specific the particular uh, missile having the system and those I am going to discuss in the further sessions. And here we will see the how the working will be taking place. This is the 
warhead means explosive which can be carried by the missile to hit the target for explosion the second one guidance and control devices where the guidance for the travel and reaching to the target it will provide and alcohol fuel tanks the commonly alcohol fuel is used in the missiles and other uh, fuel also depending upon the particular type of the missile we can use the different fuel and liquid oxygen tank the oxygen is compressed and in the liquid phase it will be used because of the more oxygen we can use in the compact space and both the fuel and the liquid oxygen will be supplied to a turbine or a pump that will supply the fuel to the combustion chamber in the combustion chamber fuel and oxygen combines and actual combustion will be taking place and produces the hot exhaust gases and these hot exhaust gases travel through the nozzle or a funnel what we can say here the through the nozzle that hot exhaust will be come out from the missile and that provides the thrust to move the missile in the forward direction and the actual the power is by using the this hot gases what is coming out of the nozzle through the missile and that will provide the force or a thrust to move in the forward direction in the upward or in a, a horizontal direction and there the control vanes also used which will be controls the its direction the variation in the direction that is change in the direction all will be controlled by using these control vanes and for the different types of the uh, missiles there are different types of the engines fuels and other control systems we are going to use differently and i am going to take the in the further session the particular types of the missile that is air to air missile and air to surface missiles ballistic missiles and tank missiles like that different missiles i am going to discuss in the further sessions thanks for watching if you like share subscribe and comment